You always want to go for the win, but I think they need to find that uh, brief road trip. And that was a Rochester team coming in hot right now, 6-0-2. Oh, and, and we are underway here at Legion Stadium. It's Wilmington Hammerheads FC and the Rochester. Try and force the game to Rochester and take it to them early on. Well, it'll be Rochester with an early attempt off the header. For a Get a free kick in this position. You definitely want to, you know, push it to the opposing team. The left foot to the far post finds the head of Troy Cole. Anthony Peters in the mix as well, but cl cleared away. Rochester, where they're going with their corner kicks. Mendoza goes to the near post, guarded by Wilmington and cleared away. Corner, so this is definitely a dangerous spot for them. Back to the near post this time. Turn to Wilmington and Rochester. Mendoza will go to the far post this time. And Peters is again. And the kick from Mendoza this time will go to the far post. Finds the head of a player and a great save by Andre Rawls. Got in his way a little bit. Mendoza sends one in. This time punched away by Rawls and cleared outside of Cole on him like glue. Obasi. Now down to the far side, the left foot. Kind of a scramble in the middle of the penalty area. And a score, even though he is up there alone. The pass just a little behind Colin Rolfe, but a chance here. Deflected away by Anthony Peter for Rochester. This time will go to the near post. Off the head, deflected off the last defender. Looked like it was number 10, Justin Moose, who got a piece of that. Low strike, deflected again once Away this time, it will go out of play. It delivers. Johnny Mendoza to the near post again, does find the foot of a Rochester. Seems to be involved, and they go to the middle of the field. They're off the header, turned away again. This time, Justin Moose there in the same exact spot. So Moose has just as many saves as Andre Roy. Take over this throwing. Yep, Brian Ackley is used to Zimmerman. And Zimmerman's had an impact since he's come on. Basagog. Trying to wiggle his way from a couple defenders, but sends Faircloth sends a ball across the field to Andre Campbell. Campbell off two hops. Second touch sends it into the middle of the field, into the box. Justin Moose off the side of the frame. And him with a goal. Let's see what the Hammerheads can do. Tomaselli goes to the middle of the field, and it's a great save there by Brandon Miller. Matt Rochester has only surrendered three goals this season as we get the second half underway. As the stadium lights begin to illuminate, where Wilmington desperately needs those three points. Absolutely. And a loose ball, hard strike, finds Peters, who has re-entered the match, and the attempt will find some space there. Off the right edge of the penalty area, Mike Garzi, and it is turned away. Here. And Mendoza will so send one to the far post, finds Obasi, the second touch, Turned away, looked like it was Andre Campbell. And Dog with some space here on the left edge. Basagog to the middle of the penalty area. Nobody home for Wilmington. Uh, one of their heads. Player down. Back to Forbes in the middle, and Obasi nearly had a chance to find the back of the net. Nicholson was in the mix, but a golden opportunity. Wonderful job by Nicholson there to stay with the run from Obasi. Well defended for Wilmington, the low strike. This is dangerous. A lot of hammerheads just sprung to the other side of the field. They got lucky, but a lot of the hammerheads, four of them. Some room to shimmy and Moose. Well, strike, and the shot attempt is saved by Brandon Miller. A great strike there from Justin Moose. Ahead for Rochester and a golden opportunity there for Brandon Martinez. And he will send the left foot in and right on a short hop to Brandon Miller. He gobbled it up for the easy save. Well, space and it's in the back of the net. Steven Umberto Fortes Dos Santos gives Rochester the 1-0 lead. 80. Find the equalizer. And it'll be Parrott to the far post. Finds Campbell. No. Now Justin Moose. Back over to Parrott. Good ball back to the outside. Parrott will send a strike in off the head of the back of the net. It's the equalizer. They level the match. A huge goal by Ashani Faircloth and Wilmington. 
has tied the game at one just moments after Rochester looked like they found the result on a goal by Duba. It's and then all of a sudden, Wilmington turns up the pressure. They get a corner kick on the, Parrot, on the yeah. cross. Uh, another sub here late in the match. We caught up with him during our halftime break. We'll have to get another look at this goal for Wilmington as Rochester now and it's a play and a run goes wide left off well, second score of the season there is a s There's now Gottelman will try to push forward and he is wrestled out of bounds or Gottelman throws down the defender Ramping, and it looks like the referee is about to blow this game dead and that is a final here at Legion Stadium a dramatic finish to tonight's match between your Wilmington Hammerheads FC and the Rochester Rhinos. As we wrap it up here at Legion Stadium, both teams are exhausted on the pitch right now. That's kind of weird.